Hi everyone, today we're back landscaping. This morning guys, I've been running around town. Late yesterday, we had a hydraulic hose broke on a skid steer, so this morning I picked up a new one and I just put it on so the employees should be up and running to continue on with their job. Like always guys, there's a full mods that's linked down below. And if you end up enjoying today's video, hit that like button, it's much appreciated. Today guys, we're going to be taking a few pieces of equipment over to a local uh, construction site uh, to do some work for a builder here. He's building 50 storage units and we are going to be uh, installing a culvert pipe here, some extra drainage pipes and we're going to be expanding the gravel parking a lot here so it should be about half day's worth of work. Oh look at that guys, looks like one of the employees got the truck and trailer ready for me, that is much appreciated. It is already 8.30 and we haven't even left the shop yet since I've been running around here, but why don't we take the Kubota, this is the SSV75 here, this will be my first job getting to use it, which I'm super excited for and we'll take the Yarnmar. Alright, let's get those heavy rams folded up here. Now, one thing, guys, uh, tying down uh, the equipment here takes quite a bit of time. Much longer than I, I would like here, but we have to do it for DOT and uh, just for safety going down the road. This summer, guys, we've been super busy with the landscaping business, which is awesome. I've been able to take you guys along quite a bit here with the camera, and I do plan uh, to do that throughout the rest of the summer. Alright, we're just getting here at the job site. Now, guys, since we're doing a lot of gravel work, I actually have our 20-ton uh, dump truck assigned to help us out today. We might need two, three uh, full uh, truck loads of gravel here. But today, guys, like I mentioned, we're going to be expanding the parking lot here. It's just a simple gravel driveway that we're going to be spreading out here. But before we could do that, we have to dig about a foot-deep trench here, put PVC piping. That way, all the water drains off the roof into the drain here and then out alongside that way it doesn't go under the garage door so we're going to be working on that and then we also have a culvert pipe this project we're going to wait to do it last year because this will take some time and i don't really want to be taking a fully loaded dump truck on a gravel driveway that i just kind of dug up here but we're going to be installing it it's a 15 foot culvert pipe and the water just is not draining to either side here so that should be uh, easy just it's going to take some time so why don't we get going first though on doing that drainage on outside of uh, both the buildings this Yanmar, guys, is perfect for today's job here. It's not too big, not too small. And I've been looking at uh, possibly buying a bigger excavator here, but I think we are going to be waiting and seeing if we could go a little bit longer uh, with the equipment we have here. Maybe wait until next season at the latest, but I think we're just going to have to end up buying one here. But let's get going. The mini Yarnmar made quick work here of it, so I'm going to do the other side here off camera. I'm also going to do the back film for either side as well, and then I'll cut you back here because that isn't really too fun, and the fun part's digging it. Alright guys, we'll just leave the Yarnmar there, but why don't we hop in the big old Mac here, and let's get this truck unloaded here. I'm super excited to really see how today's drop turns out here. Gravel work is one of my favorite things to do here in Farm Sim. It's always a really profitable thing for the business here but we'll just kind of keep pulling forward here a little bit more and the truck should be empty soon 
We have a huge 20 ton pile of gravel to spread here. I think I'm going to send them uh, to the local supplier to pick up another a full truck load here. But guys, this is going to be our first time getting to use a new Kubota. I think about a week ago we picked up the skid loader here and I've been just saving it here so I could be the first one to give it a try and I'm super excited to hear I, I'm really liking Kubota here we have a Kubota compact tractor and we did buy a second Kubota skid steer here so it's gonna be really cool uh, to see how we do here but mainly guys we're just gonna be spreading the gravel here oh yeah this is gonna turn out really good actually now that I think about it maybe one more truckload will do and uh, then we'll be done. For the most part guys, we got all the gravel laid down here, three full truckloads. That is about 60 tons of gravel here. So you guys can see we got the main area and then we got all over here. And this is about an extra 30 feet here so they could do some extra RV park and things like that here. So we're going to go here. Why don't we hop back on that yarn mark, get going on the front, see if we could get the uh, culvert pipe installed. Guys, I'm running low on battery here, so I think I'm going to conclude today's video, finish this up, and get home so I can play a little bit of farm sim. But until next time, guys, thanks for watching. Stay tuned for next one, and subscribe for more.